Hi guys, welcome to another video on Saturday around St Paddy's Day, um, the promotion which EA put on to FIFA Mobile. If you guys are new to the channel, Bates 87 Plus, make sure you do hit the subscription button and hit the bell button so you never miss an upload and become a no part of the notification gang. So today, we're continuing the theme of, <laughs> we love doing it guys, I love doing it, full squad builder around St. Paddy's. It's not going to be just Irish players. It's going to be a full St. Patrick's Day promotion squad builder. That is what we're doing. You guys have seen the players already. If you missed the pack opening from earlier on today, which you uploaded um, literally 12 hours ago, as this video does go live, um, you can see me pack some insane players. I have continued to open more, some more packs to get some more players. Um, but you can see, guys, we've got Bolger, Hayes, Ward, Bartles, Bartra, Valeri, Fernandez, Long, Evans, Carvalho, Forster, and Coleman. That is 12 players altogether, as it says, St. Patrick's player 12. And uh, there is three, obviously, master cards with William Carvalho, Forster, and Coleman being them. We were very lucky in our packs. Don't get me wrong. We were very, very lucky in our packs. And uh, hopefully we can uh, have a bit of fun today. So moving on into the team screen, guys. What's happened here? Um, moving on into the team screen. You guys can see this is my main team. They want to show off at the start of every um, game. I'm going to change the formation uh, to the 4-1-4-1 four, one, four, one formation. Actually, I want to check some at first. I do want to check some at first. I want to move into league to see if people have played me yet. I've just played my games. I'm hoping that people have not... No, they haven't. They might not notice. They might not notice. Hopefully, that's the case. So, if we move into my team, we go to the team formations. Go to the 4-1-4-1 four, one, four, one formation. And... Um, that is the team. That is the formation we're going to go with again today. I think there was only one player, guys, which is out of formation. Uh, sorry, out of position, which I think is going to be a centre forward at CM. But apart from that, everyone else is in the correct position. So we've managed to do it with only one player not getting over 100 rated. So in the goalkeeper position, guys, uh, you can see how lucky we got. We got Fraser Forster. And I think I'm going to make him my main goalkeeper. His stats are very, very good for a goalkeeper if we move on into it. Um, you guys can see he has got 114 goalkeeping position, 121 reflexes, 108 handling, 107 ref uh, reactions, and 119 diving. He looks like an absolutely brilliant goalkeeper and maybe one that I do start boosting up uh, re um, soon. In the left-back position, we have got Ward. Um, we were very lucky... We were very lucky. I don't think we were very lucky. He was on the low ones, but we did get do get Ward of uh, of Burnley in the centre back position in the middle. We have got Johnny Evans. We were able to pack four of him yesterday. Um, sorry, make that five because later on I packed him again. And then joining him is the one which I like the look of, which is Bartra um, of uh, Real Betis. You can see um, it's starting to get that green tint to the team. It looks absolutely awesome. I'm a massive fan of the uh, card art on these players. And then in the right back position, we're going to swap out Danny Alves and we are going to throw him. Seamus Coleman, the uh, 107 rated card. And guys, at the end of the video, I will show you the stats of the players at the current rating that I do have them. None of them are boosted with any training XP or anything. In the CDM position, we do take out our Mateus. We put in Bolger, which I think is the first one you do get. Uh, we, were, we were lucky to get him. In the left midfield position, we've got Manuel Fernandez. Um, a left midfielder. He's got 98 pace, which is pretty solid as well. And uh, he continues on into the midfield. In the right midfield position, we do swap out Di Maria. We're going to add in um, a, a Hayes. This card looks uh, really, it's like the card art and the pictures just go hand in hand. They look really, really good. And then the final two players, guys, in the centre midfield position, we are going to take out Hullet. We're going to put in our man, William Carvalho, who was one of the masters um, that we were able to get. I think there's three masters in the team already. Carvalho, Coleman and also uh, Force, which is a shame that Carvalho only, only has the captain skill boost, which for me is a plus 11. So the next one I'm going to do, guys is going to be this i'm going to swap out the center mid now but i'm going to but i'm going to take out griezmann and the, the reason i'm doing this guys is because it takes me so long to find the left forward and left wing um but you can see we have got center forward battles he jumps on down into the center uh, mid slash center forward position and uh, that completes the midfield you can see the different variants of the card styles as well now the final player we're going to add on in guys is taking out striker vidal who is 100 rated for me 
And then we're going to throw in the striker, and I think it's the only striker you can get from the St. Paddy's Day event. It is going to be Shane Long of Southampton. 104 pace, agility is very good as well, and that is our full St. Patrick's Day squad builder on FIFA Mobile. Hopefully you guys have enjoyed watching it. We're not finished yet, though. We are going to have a play around with it to see what we can do. I would say I'd have a play around in Versatile, but that's definitely not happening, um, as I'm still trying to get my rank up. Uh, as you can see, I've been working on that since yesterday. We're into first First class now. So world class free, uh, and hopefully later on today I will be able to push towards um, getting into uh, world class two or even world class one. So what we're going to do, guys, is we are going to test the team, and uh, I've got to be very very careful with my phone cable because I don't want to mess anything up. We are going to have a play around in one of the um, one of the challenges, but I don't know which one to go for. Maybe Italy. I don't know what te team to play against. Um, Let's go for a game against Italy, 101 rated team, and we'll play Chapter 5. And we will play, I think, Juventus. Let's play 120 rated Juventus, and then if we do alright guys, uh, we'll probably have a play around. So I'm playing the game very different, usually I have it held in my hand, um, but unfortunately it's lying flat on my desk at the moment just because of how, um, unto what, like, how broken my cable is. Uh, and... With this, guys, we are able to test what every player's like rather than just one or two of them um, in terms of uh, verse attack or even like the matches I do play in tournaments. So, Shane Long breaks on forward. It'd be nice to pick up a win. We just need to be very careful. I want to add that one of the cards I do want to test out is that Fernandez. Nice tackle by Johnny Evans. Nice tackle, right? We've seen him out of play there. That's not bad at all. Corner whipped in, please beat him to the head. We have, but he's got the rebound. Forster catches it. He is one tall goalkeeper. Let's throw the ball out to Coleman. Or I'll just hoof the ball out then. Hopefully Shane Long can pick it up, which he can. Passes it back. Ball over to Willie Carvalho. Nice roulette. Nice roulette again. He's got the rainbow as well. Wow, what a goal. What a goal that is, guys, by Willie Carvalho. He's, uh, I didn't expect that. I didn't even realise that he had the rainbow flick. I didn't think he would, but he does. He's got the rainbow flick, and that was an insane goal uh, for the first one against the 120 rated Juventus team. So now Mandzukic with the ball, he's going to turn round. We probably are going to concede against his team, because I remember doing the campaign. It was very difficult. Willy Carvalho with the ball against Bolger. He's not got the rainbow flick, but he's, he's nice at dribbling anyway. Gets a pass off to Bartles. Who isn't boosted, so I need to be very, very careful on him. Put oh tackle free kick? No. So Battles is the only player not boosted in the team. Johnny Evans. Ah, bad interception there. We get screwed in defence. Dybala's for usually when the chances come on. Oh, Forster dives the wrong way. And Dybala puts it in, making it 1-1 in this game. That's a nasty one. Shane Long, have you got Rainbow? No, he has. So, so Shane Long hasn't got the Rainbow. And it feels... I, I presume the two wingers have. Um, but Bartles doesn't. Right, come on, Shane Long. Let's go for an individual run. Nice roulette. Nice roulette. Free kick. From here, we could score an absolute banger. Maybe not enough height there. Straight into Buffon's palms. A um, little bit frustrating... This game, I haven't played. I can't remember the last time I played a campaign like this. I enjoy it though. That's a, it's actually weird that Bartle, uh, sorry, not Bartles. Here's right, so I presume that you have the rainbow flick. Run down the wing, defense is open. He, he has a rainbow flick, and we swipe it, and we've rattled it off the bar. Damn, just on the half time whistle as well. We're well, well, half time ish. Manuel, Fern Manuel Fernandez with the ball. Gets dispossessed as well, and that is half time. So, currently, guys, it's standing at 1 1. It's uh, a good game, actually. So, we have got Rainbow Flick on a few of the players just because of the skill boost that I do have, I presume. And I'm surprised that Willie Carvalho, that Willie Carvalho card must be sick. We're going to take a look at the in game, like the proper overall stats of the players to see who has got the Rainbow Flick with the boost they've got. Come on, Shane Long. Let's see. Manuel Fernandez has it. He doesn't really have the pace though. 
that was stupid on my part, trying to rainbow flick it over Quadrado, who was glued to me. Right, so here's Willy Carvalho again. Right, I need to concentrate on the game itself rather than looking at my uh, my, my monitor screen because that isn't working. Oh, good ball. Good tackle. Someone go to it. Nice battles. For a centre forward who's playing centre mid, he's doing all right. As he puts the ball out of play, but we do get it. Nice flick backwards to Evans. Evans to Manuel Fernandez. Inside there to Bartles. He gets it over to Willy Carvalho. Rainbow, but come on, someone's got the ball. Hayes has got it. He is rapid. Rainbow, but I've gone straight to the keeper. But the ball's gone over the keeper there. And it's looking like this is going to be uh, either a draw... Rainbow, nice. Rainbow and Carvalho. Oh, this card. This card is amazing. William Carvalho scoring his second goal again. An absolutely insane one as well. I'm more than happy with having him. I might look at him. I'm going to definitely look at what he looks like at 120. I love his height. No. Oh, what a save by Fraser Forster. When the computer breaks through, I'm always thinking that's going to be a goal. But that was an insane save by Fraser Forster. As the ball's whipped into the back post, Def um, defender gets in front of the uh, the striker. We just need to keep the ball away as he blazes it over. We've got seven in-game minutes left, guys, uh, of this game. We'll go for a short... Okay. As I say, I'm going to go for a short goal kick, but... I don't think it allows it to do. Willie Carvalho. Oh, ball's through already. Higuain's through. Keeper. What a save again. Fraser Forster. Man of the match for me here. Well, I don't know. I'm torn between Willie Cav. Oh, my God. It's like I want it to go to extra time, isn't it? Yeah. It's like I wanted it to go to extra time. Making stupid passes and we do make it 2-2. So, if you remember how campaign does play... We might be able to. Oh, free kick. Do we have a free... What? Ref? What? Right. Extra time, I do believe, guys. We've got 30, another 30 minutes. Shane Long. Nice. Bangs it. Oh, brilliant save by Buffon. So Shane Long, not really a fan of him. Um, literally because he's not got the rainbow flick. Well, let's see what we can do from the corner. Whipped on in. He's got the central header. Is that Bartra or is that Evans? Ward, in fact. Ward gets a header to take us 3-2 uh, into the lead against Juventus. There's still 25 in-game minutes left of this game. But, we're having fun with it. Pjanic. I'm not definitely not time-wasting. I don't even mind going to penalties. I've not done penalties in a while. Um, but we do know the computer cheats anyway. If you guys have played FIFA Mobile, you know computer cheats. Willie Carvalho will get to him. They're playing very patient stuff, but we're not going to commit uh, here. Littsteiner with the ball. See, even though Fraser Forster's conceded two guys, we could we could have been losing this game. Willie Carvalho with the ball. in. Oh, oh. Oh. Right, that makes up for that dodgy foul that they should have given us before. And that takes us into the second half of extra time. Just need to stop them from scoring for 15 minutes and we picked up a win. Let's try Shane Long. Actually, I've not got my finger on the button. Bartra doing the skills. Inside to Bolger. Controls it. Gets it through back. Bartles. I keep doing stupid stuff with players I know who are not not got the boostings up. Johnny Evans, what are you doing? Get back, son. Johnny Evans, get back into defence. We need you there. Higuain Dybala, no, no joke. We've got four in-game minutes, three in-game minutes. If they score now, Bartra, ball over to Johnny Evans, who we have pulled back, and he makes a good tackle. Ball out to Willie Carvalho. He completely hoofs it. I didn't even mean to do that, but it might be a godsend that he has done it, guys, because 120 minutes, one uh, plus one, and that is us. Looking like we've picked up a victory, guys, against the 120 Juventus team with a 101. So hopefully this does show you guys that you can beat the uh, campaign with lower-rated teams. It is uh, definitely doable, uh, even if it takes one or two times anyway. So a 1-0 victory there, and I don't even know what we get as a reward there. I've not done this one in a very, very long time. But I'm gonna, what I'm going to do is, guys, I'm going to go and take a look. Oh, not bad. 
that's definitely not bad, Quaggy Livella. Um, so we're going to move on into the team. We're going to take a look at it again. Um, mainly the p main players which I was impressed with. So Carvalho, he has some absolutely mental stats. 100 strength, 100 ball control, 100 dribbling, 83. So he's a bit slow, but he didn't feel slow. And 110 short passing. Who else have we got? Uh, who I was impressed with. I was impressed with uh, with Barter actually. 93 pace defender, not bad. Johnny Evans, a little bit slow, but 100 strength. Fraser Forster, definitely. His stats are really good. We looked at them. Shane Long, how far off he was dribbling? So he's dribbling 91. Yeah, so he's two off that, so maybe a one, one boost would have knocked him up. Bartles was all right, but centre forward is obviously a dodgy spot for everyone. Um, Bolger was all right in defensive mid. Slow, but... Um, not bad. Here's we looked at him, 120 pace. So he's got he's very fast off the bat. Um, got a small framing game as well. And that's basically us done, guys. Let's take a look at Coleman's as well because he's the best one. A very very good right back. So there we are, guys. That is the full team of St Paddy's Day. Hopefully you guys have enjoyed watching it. Have, have they played me? Have they took advantage of this sin? They haven't. So we can make our team back, guys. And uh, may maybe no mistakes at all. So, guys, leave a like, rate, and subscribe now. We'll be back another day, another video for you guys to enjoy. Probably tomorrow, we're only going to have one video because I've done a lot of videos on this channel. If you guys have missed any of them, including St. Paddy's Day or even the Versatile changes, go and check them videos out. And tomorrow, we've got another full squad builder, but something not related to any events. The logo in the left-hand side, top corner, may give you a hint. Back tomorrow. Bye-bye.